Now, tagging is different depending on profile, page, group, picture. There's all different, different, all different types of ways to tag somebody. But from a basic, we'll say from your page or from your profile, because most of you probably have a profile, you have to be connected to that person or to that page in some capacity. So from your personal profile, that person has to be your friend in order for you to tag them. And for, in order for you to be a, to tag a page, you must be a fan of that page. Or, so, or like it. Like it. That's becoming a fan, is like it. Okay. So the example that Gia's typing up here, she's at my fan page, and she typed the at symbol, no space, and started typing the name of the page that she wanted to tag. So then what it does is it brings up a drop-down menu, okay, of who I can choose from. Now, Facebook made some changes. Uh, you can do, this, you do it the same way for friends, okay? You touch the at and start typing their name. Facebook made some changes about a month or so ago that it's supposed to be if you start typing somebody's name, even without the at, it will bring up a drop-down menu. It works about 50% of the time. And it's really kind of annoying. <laughs> so I just say, just use the at, put it in there, select it from the drop-down menu, and when you do that, you see where those little blue bars up there? It'll be highlighted in a really light gray so that you know that it's that they've been tagged in. Okay? So that's how you tag from a profile or from a page. You can do the same way, you do the exact same thing inside of a comment. So if you that comment that we saw earlier, Body Beautiful, and then they tag themselves in the comment, works the exact same way. Put the at symbol, type the comment. Now, when you uh, tag somebody inside of a comment, it doesn't show up on their page, but they get a notification that says, hey, somebody tagged you in a comment. Okay, the notifications are important. Next thing I did was I tagged, well, I didn't really tag, but I put in our website, one of our websites. She put in a link, okay? So what she did is she put in a link. So she started typing a status update, and she tagged the National Business Experts, very own, tagged Heather Dobson, and tagged Gia Heller, are speaking at the American Business Women's Association about social, social media for businesses. Okay, she typed in, um, actually I'd like you to do that to use the link function. If you put in abwa.org, you should get one of our links. Yeah. You should get the national link. Can you click on this? Yep. Okay. All right. So what she did is she um, deleted it. That's okay. Oh, no, there it is. Okay. Um, so she put in there, delete that out, delete we teach you social media .com. Okay. Now go up to link. What is your website? ABWA.org. So www.abwa.org. Oh, it's a lot of W's. <laughs> .com. Okay, now click attach. Dot .org. Dot org. Dot org. Dot org. Click attach. Okay, as soon as she attaches that, look what it did. It put your website right there. Wow. Now, what she can do is she can go down and put, you can actually put the social media, or we teach you social media back in there, but I would, I would put something like, uh, learn more about us at weteachyoucialmedia.com, okay? Because now this is two links. This is two links in one update, okay? First of all, we're promoting you, and that's going to show up on the National Business Experts page, the Heather Dawson profile, profile, the Gia Heller, okay, the Heather Dawson page, the Gia Heller profile, and the Christina uh, Wagner profile. Okay? So that is putting your link in several different places, which means you're getting in front of more eyeballs than you possibly could have if you only have 25 fans on the page. Okay? Additionally, when she updates this, when she uh, shares it, where she typed in, www.weteachyousocialmedia.com, that will be a link. Also, so this is how she's getting multiple links at one time. Dude, I, I just learned this. <laughs> I just learned this. Say it again. All of it? No, oh, this last part that you just learned. Okay, so what she did is uh, she's now, because Christina's logged in to her Facebook on this computer, so they went to my fan page. Neither one of them are an admin on my fan page. So Christina.
Sheena went to my fan page, it was actually Gia, went to my fan page and started typing this. So, she clicked up there at the top where it says link, and she put in your link. She put in your link, which opened up that little box that says American Business Women's Association. She has a okay. blonde today. <laughs> All right, so then she tagged the national business experts, Heather Dobson, Gia Heller, Christina Wagner, and the Phoenix business experts. She tagged those. So every tag, that post goes out to everywhere she tags. Additionally, she typed in there, we teach you socialmedia.com, which is a link. So that's a clickable link. If you click on we teach you socialmedia.com, it takes you right to the website. So that's two links in one post. So are they, your page, how many likes did you say you have on this? Question. Somebody has a question right here. 